Pronon does not use breakpoints, but it offers functionality far richer than what breakpoints can ever provide you with. So let's take for example this binary search method and uh, say you want to examine it for bugs. In a normal debugger you would place breakpoints on it and wait for the program to run and hit the breakpoint. In Cronon you simply place your cursor inside the method and uh, hit the run to method forward in time button and it'll jump to the next call to this method from the current point in time. Similarly, you can press the run to method backward in time button and it'll jump to the previous call to this method from the current point in time. So you can run to method directly instead of placing breakpoints. Now, wh what we also have is the method history view and it shows you all the calls that were ever made to this method. And you can instantly see the return values or the arguments that were passed to each call of this method. You can click on any of the method calls and we'll jump to the the point in time when that method was called. You can see the method calls are changing by the changing green line which shows the execution path of each call. Now of course there can be many many calls to a method and we need some way to filter this list. Now in a traditional debugger you probably would use some combination of a conditional breakpoint or a breakpoint with hit counts uh, going along with a lot of trial and error. Now, what we have is something far richer than what conditional breakpoints can ever offer you. So you click this filter button over here, and it gives you this huge, rich set of filters that you can apply to these method calls. So let's say I want to see only those calls to the binary search method, which were made on the thread named, uh, say, main, and which hit a line say 80 in where the local va uh, the value of the local variable mid was let's say greater than 5 okay we add the expression and now we just press the search button and it shows me only the calls that matched all those filters and I can click on any of the calls to jump to them so you can see that all these calls hit the line 80 and the value of mid became greater than 7 and they were called on the thread main 